Get on that horse. Take that horse, Father Brigade. Lexington, I knew, was the scene of a great triumph. Now it is a place of disaster. This way. It will be faster. Mad King George is on the warpath and intends to destroy our village. We need every able body to protect it. Come with us. We know. Oyanair sent us to collect the boughs of the Great Willow. She means for us to defend our people. To make the tea? Has she lost her senses? The tea's pitfalls overshadow its power. You must not do it. You have seen what it can do. Is it dangerous? I have seen it. It is worse than dangerous. It is a promise of madness, even death for those who lack the Constitution. We cannot disobey the Clan Mother. Believe me! The tea of the Great Willow is folly. Come back with us. We will fulfill the Clan Mother's request. We will collect the bows. Speak to Oyanair, and if you can convince her, we will burn them. I intend to. What is the tea of the Great Willow? Something our people should never have discovered. It is the tea brewed of the Great Willow's virgin boughs and consumed by our warriors. It grants certain strengths for the Hungarian, but for every physical boon it gives, it robs a piece of the mind. It must never be made. Did you drink it? Never. But I have seen what happens to those who do. You are the son of a man of violence. It would affect you far more than anyone else. I will not allow you to drink it. Maker, we are not too late. You intend to brew tea of the Great Willow? Have you forgotten the consequence of drinking it? I have not. No, Ganadil. But when our people face a threat like the Mad King, there are no other paths. No other paths? We can fight them as human beings! My son and I have had success, just the two of us. Imagine the strength of our whole village. And how many of these fearless blue coats have you brought down at a time? Two? Five? Ten? Thousands will come to destroy us. Thousands that you awoke. Our people's survival depends on the strength of the Great Willow. You are as mad as the King. Do what you will. 
Then my son will not drink the tea. Then, like you, he will die. Stupid old woman. What would you have us do, Mother? We have no choice but to fight. I know. I have something that will help. Something from your father. My father? He left it for you long ago. Before he died. My father left those for me. He was part of an order, a secret brotherhood. I know who my father was, and I know what those are. You do? They will certainly help. How do you know all this? I cannot explain. Everything is all wrong here. All of this should not be. You should not be. I watched you. To the forest! Get out of here! They will show you no mercy! General Putnam. General Arnold. I sometimes despair of our project. I question my abilities and my strength. But with you two at my side, I believe we will bring liberty to this country. And we will bring it with fists of iron. And I have assurance of your loyalty. You have my solemn pledge. And mine. Thank you. Honorable gentlemen, 
This country will remember you. Give no quarter to the savages! You will not succeed here. <laughs> you? You survived. How astonishing. This time I'll make certain of your death. You are fighting the force of liberty! With my power, I will rule over a free world! that here for good measure He is awake. Where are we? A safe place, by the grace of your brothers. The village. King George burned it. It was after your mother. Your stubborn mother. Where is she? She did not listen, and now she is dead. You take the news well. It is something that I knew. That I know. But Commander Washington, the revolution, how did this come to be? No one knows how King Washington came to possess the scepter. But now that he has it, no one can stop him. We were surviving, staying out of his way. It's your mother tried to steal it from him. And that just angered him more. Now, our king are dead. And the people of the frontier are murdered and imprisoned. How did we survive? By the strength granted us. By the Great Willow. A strength you now must find. But my mother, she said... Your mother was a fool, full of ideals and bullheaded. Now that King George's power has been threatened, he is making slaves of everyone. Redonagedon. It falls to you to make good on your mother's mistake. Journey to the Great Willow. Climb her. Retrieve the virgin boughs in her canopy. Drink their essence and gain the power to fight. To bring down this mad King George. What power? Gather your strength, and I will show you.
You are ready. Great Willow, at the top of the mountain. Yes. I will return with the boughs and perhaps some fresh meat to cook. Oh, never mind the meat. Just bring back the branches, boil them in water, and drink the tea. Only then will you be ready to return and fight back with your brothers. Drink her strength. Become one of us. Leave no tracks leading here upon your return. Go! I will meet you at the Red Willow Tree. <laughs>